Hey guys, and welcome to episode 22 of my Minecraft Let's Play series. And today, we're gonna be doing a bit of this, that, and everything else in between. So, in the last episode, I built this automatic kelp farm. And, um, yeah, I wanna make sure that it at least harvests once. To make sure that it actually, you know, works. But... Um, right at the end of recording that video, the Minecraft 1.18 update came out. So, I just updated this world, and it's now in 1.18, and I know for you guys it 1.18 came out, like, three months ago. So, or actually six months ago. But, uh, yeah, pre-recording and stuff. So, I already have explored a bit of what 1.18 is like. But not on this world while this carrot farm is laggy. Anyway, um, so I'm thinking that I want to try and find some of the new caves. Now the reason I'm not going to try and look for any of the new cliffs is because we've explored so far in every direction that I'm going to save that for a special episode in the future. But for now I'm going to Head underground, get mining, and I will let you guys know if I find any new caves. Okay, I, as you can see, I just started digging down, and I think I already found it. Wow, I nailed that water bucket clutch. I think I already found a new cave. Well, this is definitely new. Definitely new. Since I'm at negative 12 right now. Uh, oh my gosh, I can't even see the floor down there. Yeah, I, 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 I'm not going down that hole. Um, I do have feather falling, and technically, no matter how far that would go down, I'd live. But I still don't trust it. So, I'm not going down there. So this is where bedrock used to be, hence the slab of deep slate. And in either my next Let's Play video or the one after that, I'm going to do stuff all about 1.18 and show a bunch more of what came out in the update and do a deep dive. But, um, yeah, glad I already found a... Is that diamonds? Wow, I'm blind. Yeah, that's diamonds. Okay, well, I'll take the three diamonds. Or one. Right, I thought I had fortune and I don't. Duh. Anyway, um, I'm just going to get out of here now that I know where a nice cave system is for next video. And now I want to get doing some more farming stuff. So I need a lot more wood, and so I'm just going to manually farm that. But hopefully my automatic uh, kelp farm will be working in the background. And I was just lost, but... I'm going to go get a bunch more wood and move some stuff out of the mine up. And I will see you guys when all that's done or when my kelp farm's ready to harvest. Okay, guys, so I got a lot of the stuff done. Kelp farm's still going in the background. Also, can -Am jumped on and he's somewhere around here doing something. I don't know. But I realized that I have 31 levels. Oh, looks like he's grabbing wheat. But I want to try and enchant something now. I checked my axe and book, couldn't get anything good, so I'm just going to put efficiency 2 on this. And, uh, yeah. Now, hope I get something better. Prop 4, have a villager for it. And this axe. Bane of arthropods, bane of arthropods, and bane of arthropods. Huh. <sighs> well, at least I have an efficiency 2 eye on axe. Um, hi. So, yeah. Still trying to get good enchantments on that, and I still forgot to put mending on my Silk Touch pickaxe. I've only been meaning to do that for like the past six episodes. And I'll get to it eventually. But got a bunch more wood. Now, I want to check the kelp farm and make sure it is actually growing. Because I highly 
doubt that I made a mistake, but knowing me, it's possible that I screwed something up and it's not growing. I can't tell if it's growing. Okay. Well, that's not a necessarily good sign, but it's not a bad sign either. Anyway, um, I'll get back to that in a minute. But, I did enough mining that I have a bunch more blocks of copper to put on the automatic wheat farm. So, I managed to get, where is it here? There we go. Enough for three more rows, which means I need three more honeycomb. And I probably should harvest the automatic, not automatic, sorry, the honey farm soon. I think all my bees are dead. And what else is new? Anyway, um, I'm just gonna head over here and put in three more rows. And it is absolutely unreal the amount of time it takes to get copper. Like, the amount of copper needed for this project, I thought it would be like a two second job type thing. Yeah, no, this, this is literally taking forever. There we go. Three more rows in, and that makes it look a lot more complete. So, uh, eventually, if you guys weren't here when this is built, we're gonna get a full copper border and do a gradient starting from no oxidization up to full oxidization. So, uh, that is well in progress. Now, I'm just going to AFK at the kelp farm and see if it w is actually functional okay guys I was just still kind of walking around in circles waiting for the kelp to grow the stuff in the mob farm and apparently they're not one hit oh no I didn't know creepers could blow up um well I knew creepers could blow up I just didn't know that they could blow up in the mob farm, but it's actually produced stuff. It's actually produced stuff. Of course, I've had it for like eh, 11 episodes and it's produced like two gunpowder on top of what you see. So not very efficient, but it has produced. So um, comment down below if you still want me to destroy this and um, I might have already done it by the time this video comes out, but uh, if I haven't, then I'll definitely get onto it off your comments. But uh, back to AFK for me. Okay, so the kelp farm still hasn't produced, but I managed to hit level 30 again. And this guy's just damaging my armor, thanks. Now, I'll just go motor him in a second, but. Sharpness 3, I'm gonna take a chance, I'm hoping for efficiency, and I'm breaking. Well, I'm breaking I can get from a villager, please. Efficiency! Yes! A good axe! Then I can get I'm breaking and mending from my villagers, and where is Canyon? I have to go murder him. But anyway, the kelp farm is working, I swam down and kelp is growing and I did a dummy test on it that the kelp will flow up so I am going to continue to AFK around here and get this to keep growing but I'm probably gonna just you know track down Can-Am as well and I'm just gonna steal a block of kelp from there to cook more potatoes but, uh, yeah, I will let you guys know when it finally produced, uh, and this is like my tenth time saying this, but this time will definitely be the time. Okay, guys, so I'm kind of out of time for recording, but as you can see down here, oh, one of the kelp pieces got broken. Whoops. And now it just reappeared. Whatever. But, um, kelp is growing, and whenever it gets to the top, the system does work. I showed that in my last episode, so go check that out. Um, 
And I'm drowning, I am drowning, I am drowning. Okay, not drowning. So I have a background noise. But, this is working. A lot slower than I expected, but it will eventually get to the top and be harvested. So, it does work. It's just way, way slower than I wanted it to be. But, it should still definitely help a major amount with my fuel problem. But if you enjoy my content, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.